Good morning. How are you feeling today? I am feeling happy today. Today is Wednesday. What letter makes the W sound? W, W, Wednesday. And it is May, M, E, Y. Which word makes those sounds? Here, the M, the A, the Y, May. And today is 27. Two and a seven together. Here's a two, here's a seven. Can you find them together? Here it is. Oops. There we go. And the year is 2020. Tomorrow will be what day? What comes after Wednesday? Does Tuesday come after Wednesday or Thursday come after? Thursday. And it will be May. And what number comes after 27? 26 or 28? 28. Okay, the day before Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So Tuesdays before. And what comes before 27? 26 or 29? 26 is before. All right. All right, another sunny day. Where's the sun? There it is, and it's going to be 23. Let's count from 20. 20, 21, 22, 23. So 23 right in here in this orange area. So let's say warm. All right. Let's do some money math. So here we have what? Got a polar bear. It is two colors called the toonie. It's two. Ooh, that wasn't a very good two, was it? Let's try that again. Two dollars. And then here we have our small coin boat on it called the dime. How much is it worth? 10 cents. Okay, last coin has a beaver. It's called the nickel. How much is it? 5 cents. All right, let's add them up. So what happens when we add zero? We don't add anything. We're adding nothing. So five plus nothing plus nothing is five. Same thing here, one and a zero and a zero is one. And then here, two plus zero plus zero is two. So, Easy adding today. We just had to add things to zeros. We have $2.15. The 10 and the 5 makes 15. See, 10, let's add 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 15. So $2.15. Okay, our social skill of the day. Being open to thoughts, feelings, and ideas. Everyone has different thoughts, feelings, and ideas about different things. When you are working in a group or as a team, it is important to listen to the thoughts, feelings, and ideas of others. If someone shares a thought, feeling, or idea, think about how it can be included into what you are doing together. Being open is another way to keep things fair. Trying to use only your ideas all the time isn't fair and might even seem bossy. And this is something good to remember even now when you are at home, maybe um, with your siblings, your brothers and sisters, or with your parents, 
um, everybody, your parents, your sister, your brother has different thoughts and feelings and ideas about things. And it's important to listen to their thoughts and feelings and not just think that what you think is right. We gotta make space for everyone. Okay. Question of the day. Question of the day today is, what do you like? Pudding, ice cream, or crackers? All right, whoops. So, pick which one you like, pudding, ice cream, and crackers, and then tell me why. Because it's yummy, it's healthy. Which one of these is healthy? The crackers. Maybe it's your favorite food. Maybe you like to eat it for dessert. Probably ice cream or pudding you would eat for dessert. Uh, maybe you like to eat it as a snack. You could eat any of these as a snack. Maybe you like to eat it in the summer. Which one would you eat in the summer? The ice cream. Maybe you like it because it's sweet. Ice cream and pudding. Maybe you like to buy it. So maybe you like to buy ice cream. Maybe you like to buy crackers. Maybe you like to eat it with cheese. Which one would you eat with cheese? The crackers. And maybe you like it because it has different flavors. So there's crackers with different flavors. There's lots of different ice cream flavors. And there's a couple different pudding flavors. So tell me why it is that you like pudding, ice cream, or crackers. Okay, you guys, that's it for today. See you again tomorrow.